Hi, this is Sarah here at ToyCon Las Vegas 2020, and I'm here with Fred Ottman, also known as Tugboat. You guys might know him. Tugboat Typhoon, the shock master in the B-A-double-D. Big Steel Man coming at you live from the ToyCon. Ooh, it's awesome being here. Thank you. It's great to have you. Thanks for coming. So Thank what you. are your thoughts? Is this your first uh, time at ToyCon in Las Vegas? First time ToyCon in Las Vegas, and I spent money yesterday. I am a toy guy. Comic books, toys, I have all the stuff, and I even build hot rods. So I had a great, I've met a, the staff here has been absolutely awesome. They're treated like gold. Met a lot of great people out on the, the midway there because, you know, these toy cons are like a carnival. And i uh, just been having a good time and meeting people, talking to people, and you know, networking, you know, and saying hi. What are your thoughts on uh, current WWE? I you know, I love it. I, I mean, there's a lot of, I mean, AEW. You got Ring of Honor. I mean, at AEW, you got a lot of great talent that's out there. Uh, you know, the NXT pro uh, property also. I mean, it is good. There's a lot of great stuff there. There's a lot of guys that are armchair quarterbacks that sit home and judge people. But the uh, best thing to do is keep your mouth shut, sit back, relax, and have fun, and watch and enjoy. Not everybody likes the main event. Some people come for the first match. You know, everybody has their favorites. Do you, do you miss it still? Uh, no, these are great because I get to see guys they don't see on a, on a often enough basis. Yeah. So it's kind of, you know, it's a neat kind of deal. Uh, I miss it, but I know my boundaries in, uh, at uh, nearly 65 years old. You know, I go to the gym and everything, so I'm able to walk and, and chew gum at the same time. But, you know, uh, it, it's, all, it's in my blood. I was a wrestling fan since I'm about 10 years old. I became a wrestler, wrestled for about 28 years. Minimal 300 days a year of wrestling. Been to almost 40 countries, you know, and wrestled all over this country. And uh, it's, it, it's given me the opportunity to meet people from different cultures, open my eyes and, and, you know, enjoy life and appreciate what's around me. I appreciate much more when I get home, you know, and, but I enjoy being and seeing and doing different things. And so it's been a great life. Do you have any fun stories from your wrestling days that you could share? I, I plead the fifth <laughs> because all only stories they want to hear about is the dirt. Okay, they asked me to write a book and this and that. And I says, no, 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 I'm okay. Well, what, what about fond memories? Fond memories, the whole business is fond memories. I've had the, some of the Undertaker's first matches. I've been, gotten to wrestle with guys that were, uh, I watched on TV when I was young and actually got to wrestle with those guys. And, uh, my, and uh, Dusty Rhodes one of the, that was a very famous character back in the day. He was my, became my brother-in-law. And uh, Cody and uh, Cody Rhodes and, and Dustin are my nephews. And Jerry Sags and the Nasty Boys, uh, another brother-in-law. So Thanksgiving's a wild time, you know what I'm saying? But it, very, very cool, very nice. And uh, it's, it's been a pleasure, you know. It, it, and I still am a wrestling fan. I still watch the product. All different, you know, all different companies. My tag team partner was Earthquake. And uh, I, I got to take and tag with and wrestle against Hulk Hogan. But uh, my time spent with Earthquake, he's like my brother from another mother. He's no longer with us. And uh, when we wrestled the Road Warriors and Money Incorporated, okay, IRS and uh, Ted DiBiase, some of the, a, a lot of fond memories there. But, you know, like I said, I wrestled a whole lot of people and uh, a lot of good memories. That's why, you know, when you ask about stories, <laughs> some stories need to be just in here. So when I'm old and confused, I'll get a flashback maybe sometime. <laughs> like I was doing acid in the, in the past time. <laughs>